Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. If you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, please click the subscribe button and the bell icon for more videos. We are always looking for ways to spice up potted house plants. And if you can tell, we love DIY projects too. Today we have gathered our favorite DIY wooden plant stand ideas. Whether you have big plants or small plants in your living room or outdoors. Traditional plant stands seem to come in two styles. Those mid-century modern ones that stay low to the ground and fit just one big pot. And the more bookshelf style bamboo units with a few shelves that can hold a bunch of smaller plants. Both these styles can be good looking and super functional, but they're also a bit limiting. Thankfully, a plant stand can really be any object you can place a plant on. And with one sweep of the internet, we'll reveal that you can put plants on lots of things. If you have a medium-sized plant teetering off the edge of your windowsill, why not put it on top of a stool instead, or a bucket, or floating shelves? If you are a bit of a plant holder, with every square inch of floor and table surfaces covered, you can use rolling utility cards, shoe benches, or bookcases to better organize your collection. No matter what kind of stand you choose, though you will want something that has an open design to let in light and that can support a decent amount of weight and hold up to the occasional water spill. Below, we have rounded up some plant stands we like along with a few bookshelves, end tables, stepped stools, art supply cards, wooden crates and more things you can also definitely put plants on. With hundreds of different DIY plant stand ideas, you can choose from tiered plant stands to wooden and mid-century. We have got plenty of affordable and reclaimed options for you to easily give your green friends their new home. When designing which one or more than one you want to make, keep in mind your space, plant and pot size and of course your preferred style. These can all be made in different heights and sizes so you can personalize your space to fit your favorite green friends. Even switch some of these with a can of spray paint or your favorite wood stain. Making your own plant stands is a great way to save money while personalizing your space or garden. Many of these DIY projects are open to customization to let your creative side shine. Plus, DIY plant stands are also a great way to save money and reduce waste in the environment when using scrap wood and supplies you have around the house. If you are looking at this video, you most likely love lots and lots of plants in your home. Having plants in your home is on trend right now. It is easy to bring in the organic element and texture and beauty by simply adding plants. Plants in your home is not just trendy. They can help improve the quality of air in your home as well. To make your plant collection even more interesting, you can add plant stands to the mix. What can you use for a plant stand? Plant stands can be made in a variety of ways. The most common material to build plant stands is wood because you can build it to fit your pots 
and it can be painted and stained as needed. In addition, you could upcycle various thrifted items such as old drawers, stools, baskets, chairs, etc. to make your own plant stand. How tall a plant stand should be? The height of a plant stand depends on lots of factors. The location and the size of plant being the most significant. You might want to use low plant stands for taller plants and taller plant stands for small plants. Or you may want to create a varied look and mix it up. It really just depends on your decor. Plant lovers always find a way to add more pots to their home. So stands like the ones we have gone over are essential. They will help you keep order among your plants and your house look better. I hope you were inspired to skip the store and create your own DIY plant stand instead. Which one of these ideas was your favorite? I'd love to hear from you in the comments. If you would like to keep up to date with my latest videos about DIY projects, woodworking and more, you can subscribe us and click the bell icon for notified when we upload a new video to the channel.